What if I told you that Tesla just dropped a robot that could completely change everything we know about automation? We're talking about a machine that moves so smoothly, it's almost unsettling, and has vision capabilities that put most humans to shame. But here's the kicker. Elon Musk thinks we'll need two of these for every person on Earth. Sounds crazy, right? Well, buckle up, because what you're about to discover might just blow your mind. Hey everyone! I'm Danny, and welcome back to Danny Nova. If you're new here, we dive deep into the latest Tesla innovations and cutting-edge robotics that are literally reshaping our world. Today, we're unpacking Tesla's brand new Optimus Gen 3. And trust me, this isn't just another incremental update. We're looking at a complete game changer that's making some seriously bold promises about the future of work, home life, and even space exploration. Now, before we jump into the mind-blowing details, I'd love your help in reaching our goal of one subscriber. Every subscription means the world to us and keeps us motivated to bring you the absolute best content about Tesla, Optimus, and all the latest tech breakthroughs. So if you enjoy what you're about to hear, hit that subscribe button and let's build this community together. Tesla has been absolutely crushing it with their regular Optimus updates, and Elon Musk keeps making these increasingly bold claims about what this robot can actually do. But here's what's different about Gen 3. It's not just talk anymore. This machine represents Tesla's relentless push toward innovation, and with its dramatically enhanced speed, cutting-edge vision system, and some seriously strategic market positioning, we're looking at a robot that could literally redefine what we think machines are capable of. So the big question everyone's asking is, how exactly will this new development impact Optimus's potential across all these different industries? Are we really looking at the future of work here? Or is this just another overhyped tech promise? Let's dig in and find out. The heart of what makes Optimus Gen 3 so remarkable lies in its completely redesigned actuator system. Now, I know, actuator system might sound super technical, but think of it this way. These are basically the robot's muscles, and Tesla just gave them a massive upgrade. When we talk about speeding humanoid robots, we're not just talking about how fast they can run down a hallway. We're talking about agility, precision, and the ability to handle complex tasks without missing a beat. According to a recent video that Elon Musk shared, Optimus Gen 3 can now hit speeds of around 5 mph. Now that might not sound like much, might not sound like much compared to your morning jog, but here's why it's actually incredible. That's a 30% jump from Gen 2 3. 7 mph, and get this, it's four times faster than, quote, those initial prototypes that could barely manage one. 2 mph. But here's what really matters. This isn't just about bigger numbers on the spec sheet. This speed increase means we're looking at a robot that can navigate dynamic environments like factories or even your home with this unprecedented level of fluidity. Can you imagine having a helper that moves this smoothly through your kitchen while you're cooking dinner? Now, let's talk about what's actually making this speed possible. The actuators, those robot muscles I mentioned, are converting electrical energy into mechanical motion, and Tesla has integrated these higher efficiency electric motors that pump out 10% more power than, quote, what we saw in Gen 2. These motors are specifically designed to optimize both power and torque, which allows the robot to move with precision down to within one millimeter. That's insane when you think about it. We're talking about a level of exactness that's crucial for tasks like assembling tiny components or handling delicate objects without breaking them. The increased power also means faster response times when the robot encounters something unexpected in its environment. So if something suddenly changes around it, Optimus can adapt way more quickly than before, making it much more practical for real-world scenarios. But Tesla didn't stop there. They completely redesigned the gearbox to be both lighter and more robust. This new gearbox cuts energy loss by approximately 15%, which means the robot can keep working longer without needing to plug in for a recharge. Plus, it boosts responsiveness by 20%, which eliminates those jerky robotic movements that made Gen 2 look a bit awkward at times. The improvements go even deeper into the robot's sensory systems. The upgraded force and inertial sensors in Gen 3 play this pivotal role in maintaining balance and stability. These sensors are now twice as accurate as the ones in Gen 2, and they can adjust to within 0.1 newton of force compared to 0.3 newton previously. 
This heightened sensitivity allows the robot to make real-time adjustments to its movements, dramatically reducing the risk of falls or missteps, even when things get unpredictable. Picture this scenario. Optimus encounters an uneven surface or bumps into an unexpected obstacle. Both sensors enable it to recalibrate its movement almost instantly, ensuring it keeps operating smoothly. It's like having a built-in sense of balance that's actually better than most humans. Finally, there's this optimized control algorithm in Gen 3 that synchronizes movements across all joints, and this is where things get really impressive. Response times have dropped from 150 milliseconds in Gen 2 to just 50 milliseconds. To put that in perspective, it's like upgrading from dial up internet to fiber optics. The difference is absolutely night and day. This algorithm calculates and adjusts torque in real time, creating this harmonious flow of motion that actually mimics natural human movement. This is particularly valuable for tasks that require both speed and precision, like transporting goods in a manufacturing plant or helping out with household chores around your home. When we stack Optimus Gen 3 up against its competitors, it's holding its own and in many cases, actually surpassing them. Take Boston Dynamics Atlas Robot, which is famous for its agility and can hit speeds up to 5.6 mph. But here's the thing, Atlas is primarily focused on mobility rather than practical industrial applications. Meanwhile, Honda's ASIMO, which was a real pioneer in humanoid robotics, maxes out at just 1.7 mph. That really highlights how far Tesla has come in a relatively short period of time. Do you think Tesla's focus on practical applications gives them an edge over competitors who prioritize pure mobility? Pure mobility? That's something worth considering as we move forward. With all these advancements, Tesla isn't just keeping pace with the industry, they're setting a completely new standard for what humanoid robots can achieve. But speed is just one piece of the puzzle. While speed is absolutely crucial, the real potential of a humanoid robot comes down to its ability to perceive and interact with its environment intelligently. This is where Optimus Gen 3 enhanced vision capabilities really shine, and frankly, this might be the most impressive part of the whole system. Milan Kovac, Tesla's former director of Optimus and Autopilot Engineering, has emphasized that the robot's vision system and neural networks have undergone these significant upgrades, allowing it to process data from cameras and sensors with unprecedented precision. But this development isn't just about seeing better. It's about understanding the world in a way that enables truly autonomous decision-making. At the core of this vision system is a single neural network that processes data from multiple cameras and sensors to create this detailed 3D model of the environment. Unlike traditional systems that rely on LiDAR or radar, Optimus Gen 3 uses what's called a voxel-based approach. Essentially, it divides space into these tiny 3D units and predicts their occupancy, shape, and movement in real time. This method, which has been praised by the tech community for its efficiency, allows the robot to recognize objects, anticipate changes, and navigate complex spaces without any external aids. Imagine Optimus working in a factory setting, it can identify different workstations, avoid moving machinery, and even predict the path of human workers to prevent collisions. That level of spatial awareness is genuinely remarkable. This vision system also dramatically enhances the robot's ability to recover from unexpected events. Even if Optimus slips or falls, it can quickly regain its balance thanks to its real-time environmental awareness. This resilience comes directly from the AI stack that's shared with Tesla's full self-driving technology, which processes visual data to make split-second decisions. With eight cameras providing a complete 360-degree field of view, Optimus can monitor its surroundings comprehensively, making it ideal for dynamic environments like Tesla's own factories. But the applications go way beyond just industrial settings. The vision enhancements enable Optimus to interact more naturally with humans and its surroundings. The robot comes equipped with speech recognition and can communicate through built-in microphones, allowing it to respond to voice commands or engage in simple conversations. During recent demonstrations, Optimus impressed audiences by communicating in multiple languages, showcasing its potential as a truly global assistant. Can you imagine having a conversation with your household robot in multiple languages? This feature is particularly valuable in domestic settings where the robot could serve as a household aid, performing tasks like cleaning, cooking, or even providing companionship for elderly family members or people who live alone. Here's where we're at the halfway point of our deep dive, and I'm genuinely curious, are you starting to see the potential here, 
or does this still feel like science fiction to you? If you're finding this as fascinating as I am, this would be a perfect time to hit that subscribe button and help us reach our goal of one subscriber. We're building something special here at Danny Nova, and your support makes all the difference. The applications of Optimus extend far beyond just the factory floor. Its ability to operate in harsh conditions such as extreme temperatures or environments requiring precision makes it a versatile tool for industries ranging from manufacturing to healthcare. In healthcare, for instance, Optimus could assist with patient mobility or medication delivery tasks that require both physical capability and environmental awareness. The robot's neural network also benefits from this shared knowledge map, allowing different units to exchange data and learn from each other's experiences. This collective intelligence ensures that each Optimus robot becomes smarter over time, adapting to new challenges and refining its performance based on what other robots have learned. Safety is another area where vision plays this critical role. Optimus has been trained to fall and recover naturally, minimizing the risk of damage to itself or its surroundings. This capability, combined with its ability to adjust movements based on real-time data, makes it a reliable and safe companion in both industrial and personal settings. As Tesla continues to refine these features, Optimus is set to become not just a tool, but a trusted partner in various aspects of life. But how exactly does Tesla plan to get these robots into the hands of consumers and businesses? CEO Elon Musk recently announced that the Fremont factory has produced the first humanoid robot from the Optimus production line. Musk also noted that while Tesla's internal goal is to have enough parts to produce 1 to 12 Optimus robots this year, the company is fully capable of producing five humanoid robots 2025. But here's where things get really wild. Musk has these other ambitious plans for Optimus. He envisions having two humanoid robots for every person on the planet in the future. With that sink in for a moment, we're talking about a staggering production speed of 1 billion humanoid robots per year, with Tesla planning to build at least 1 million per year or more initially. With these numbers, Tesla sees Optimus's market capitalization potentially doubling that of their full self-driving technology, reaching around $2 trillion, trillion, with expected profits of $1 trillion, trillion, annually at scale. That's an expected profit of $1 expected profit of $1 per unit, which would be a significant achievement given that Tesla is still planning to modify the design as they scale up production. However, large-scale production won't begin immediately. Elon Musk mentioned that Tesla is currently planning to deploy around one to two Optimus units for internal use at Tesla factories by the end of next year. This limited production run will serve as the launching point for larger Optimus deployments and will help them refine the full self-driving stack that runs Optimus, teaching it the many tasks it can perform in a factory, quote, setting. Optimus benefits from shared technology with Tesla's self-driving cars, particularly in actuators and sensors, allowing for cost-effective component sourcing. Musk has confirmed that the Gen 3 production line is being designed to scale up to one units per month by 2026. This long-term confidence in market demand suggests that Tesla envisions a substantial role for humanoid robots across various industries. Critics have questioned Tesla's ability to meet such ambitious targets, citing past delays in projects like the Tesla Roadster. However, the Optimus program holds some distinct advantages. Unlike the Roadster, which required an entirely new supply chain, the Gen 3 Optimus capitalizes on Tesla's existing partnerships with semiconductor and battery suppliers. Additionally, the recent reconfiguration of the Fremont factory for Cybertruck production serves as a blueprint for rapidly scaling robot manufacturing. Musk recently revealed that Tesla is actively testing Optimus prototypes within its own factories, where they perform logistical tasks such as retrieving parts and overseeing assembly lines. Tesla's vast real-world data advantage is also a key factor here. With over 5 million Tesla vehicles on the road generating driving data, the company has accumulated this massive data set that directly informs AI training for Optimus. This symbiotic relationship between Tesla's automotive and robotics divisions accelerates problem solving in ways that most competitors simply can't match. Navigation algorithms developed for full self-driving are being adapted for mobile robots, enhancing their ability to function autonomously in complex environments. Looking beyond 2025, Musk envisions Tesla eventually producing 1 million Optimus robots annually, with the program becoming a major revenue driver. 
While this forecast may seem highly ambitious, the underlying economics are actually quite compelling. At an expected retail price of $22 per unit, Optimus could generate $2 billion billion in annual revenue once production reaches 1 million units per year. These applications are currently in the final testing phase before mass production and market launch in 2025. Speaking of space exploration, here's something really interesting Musk has hinted at deploying Tesla bots for maintenance tasks in future SpaceX Mars colonies instead of relying solely on human labour. SpaceX engineers are developing robots equipped with sealed joints and radiation-resistant electronics to construct habitats in these extreme conditions. There's also speculation that Optimus will be tailored specifically for Tesla's automotive manufacturing operations, though there's no definitive confirmation of a civilian use version at this stage. Currently, nearly one humanoid robots are in operation across Tesla's factories, assisting with production and continuously collecting data for future iterations. This number is expected to surge dramatically in the near future. Musk has grown increasingly confident in Optimus's scaling potential, suggesting a humanoid-to-human -human ratio of at least 3-1 or even 5-1 in industrial settings. With projections reaching 2-3 to 3 billion humanoid robots globally, the potential market is absolutely immense. Despite Tesla's history of delays in launching new electric vehicles, the development of Optimus is progressing at an unprecedented pace, actually surpassing initial expectations. The rapid advancement from Optimus Gen 1 and Gen 2 has, has paved the way for Tesla to introduce this premium Optimus Gen 3 model this year. In recent demonstrations, Optimus has showcased remarkable mobility, navigating complex workspaces alongside human workers and automated systems. Unlike traditional industrial robots that rely on predefined maps or guidance systems, Optimus autonomously scans and interprets its environment, identifying machines, workers and spatial data, inform its movements. This capability allows it to function efficiently in Tesla's factories, reinforcing Musk's belief that humanoid robots will revolutionise entire industries. Do you think Tesla can actually meet these ambitious production targets, or are we looking at another case of overpromising? The track record is mixed, but the technology seems more solid this time around. Investors are pouring billions into robotic startups, with the global humanoid robot market projected to reach $3.8 billion billion by 2035. Companies across North America, China and Europe are entering this space at an unprecedented rate, which tells us that the smart money believes this technology is about to hit a major inflection point. Here's what really matters about everything we've covered today. Tesla's Optimus Gen 3 isn't just another robot announcement. We're looking at a convergence of advanced actuator technology, cutting-edge AI vision systems, and a production strategy that leverages Tesla's existing automotive expertise. The speed improvements alone make this robot viable for real-world applications, but it's the vision capabilities that could make it truly revolutionary. The fact that Tesla is planning to deploy these robots in their own factories first is smart. It gives them a controlled environment to refine the technology while generating real value from day one. And if they can crack the code on mass production the way they did with electric vehicles, we could be looking at a fundamental shift in how work gets done across multiple industries. Whether it's manufacturing, healthcare, retail, or even space exploration, Optimus Gen 3 seems positioned to be more than just a tool, it could become a genuine partner in human productivity. Progress. What do you think about all this? Are you excited about the potential of having humanoid robots as part of our daily lives? Or does it make you nervous about the future of human employment? I'm genuinely curious to hear your thoughts, so drop a comment below and let's get a conversation going. If this deep dive into Tesla's latest innovation has been valuable to you, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps us reach more people who are passionate about cutting-edge technology. And if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to Danny Nova and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any of our upcoming videos about Tesla, robotics, and the technologies that are shaping our future. We're working toward that goal of one subscriber, and every single subscription helps us continue bringing you the best information and analysis. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, stay curious and keep exploring the future with us.